Wait, oh, top of the morning to you, laddie. This be your exuberant covering more of your goofs. Oof. And let's not forget the winner of the poll, Olaf, of this week. I think, of course, we're gonna follow that rainbow into a pot of gold. Anyway, this week, Percy proves a point in order to get green with envy. Or Percy and Harold if you're from the UK. I'm the UK. Get on over the, the rainbow. Turn to a pot of gold. And let's get this rolling. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, guys. Percy worked hard at the new harbor. Ugh, reckless at the start, guys. Really? Percy worked. They put something in the way right there. That could have been deadly had there been explosives. Hard at the new harbor. The workmen needed stone for their building. Toby helped, but sometimes the loads of stone were too heavy, and Percy had to fetch them for himself. Sometimes he. Also, Percy's eyes are really wonky. Not compared to Thomas going toothless. See Thomas. Also, there's no light in Thomas's lantern. Well done. Hey, at least some of these eyes don't look wonky. Okay, now there is a light in there. Percy, Sir Topham Hat is very pleased with us. Ew! Oh my god, what the heck just happened? Don Percy, Sir Topham Hat is very pleased with us. Ew, it looks like he put super glue on it, or maybe some sort of lubricant, on the middle uh, lamp post. As if we didn't need to see anything disgusting. An airfield was close by. Percy heard the airplane zooming overhead all day. The noisiest of all was a helicopter. <laughs> Stupid thing, said Percy. Why can't he... Wow, and you fixed your wonk, now it's back again? Go and buzz somewhere else. One day, Percy stopped at the airfield. Hello, said Percy. Who are you? I'm Harold, said the helicopter. Who are you? I'm Percy. Wait, wait, whoa, hold the phone. That's another goof right there. Hello, said <laughs> Percy. Who are you? I'm... You saw that, right? The, the eye... The black part of the left eye is literally outside the lines, guys. Nobody's dark part of their eye goes outside their socket. Harold, said the helicopter, who are you? I'm Percy. What really great arms you've got. They're nice arms, said Harold. I could hover like a bird. Don't you wish you could hover? Certainly not. I like my rails, thank you. I think railways are slow, said Harold. They're not much use and quite out of date. He whirled his arms and buzzed away. Yeah, the wind sock's moving, but that's correct, actually. Unfortunately, now they're using plastic thingies as props. Percy found Toby at the quarry. I say, Toby, that Harold, that stuck-up whirlybird thing, says I'm slow and out of date. Just let him wait. I'll show him. He collected his freight cars. 
His eyes are much wonkier than usual, by the way. Percy's is. Oh, and now Toby's got a case of the wonk side issue. Started off still fuming. Heard a familiar buzzing. Percy, whispered his driver. There's Harold. He's not far ahead. Let's race him. Yes, let's, said Percy. Wait a minute. Percy, whispered his driver. There's Harold. He's not far ahead. Let's race him. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that after you fix your left eye gap. Let's, said Percy. Percy pounded along. The car screamed and swayed. Well, I'll be a ding-dong dang, said the... Yeah, you notice a goof right here. That's Henry's cab, not Percy's. And this is from season one. And this is also from season one, by the way. Driver, there was Harold. The race was on. Go it, Percy, he yelled. You're gaining. Percy had never been allowed to run fast before. He was having the time of his life. Hurry, 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 he panted to the cars. We don't want to, we don't want to, they grumbled. It was no use. Percy was bucketing along with flying wheels, and Harold was high and alongside. Oh, the amount of cars are decreasing as well. Oh, don't think anyone noticed that. The fireman shoveled for dear life. Well done, Percy shouted the driver. We're gaining. We're going ahead. Oh, good boy. Good boy. A distant signal warned them that the harbor wharf was near. Peep, peep, peep! Brakes conductor! Oh, wait. A minute ago, there were like five cars. Now there are four. Or right here. Please! Driver carefully check the train's headlong speed. They rolled under the main line and halted on the wharf. Oh dear, groaned Percy. I'm sure we've lost. The fireman scrambled to the cab roof. We've won! We've won! He shouted. Wait a minute. Dear, groaned Wait, Percy. Wait, hold on. I'm sure we've lost. The fireman scrambled. He looks very rusty in this figurine. Even when he scrambles up to the roof. To the cab roof. We and they cleaned him off. Off in the next scene. Won! We've won! He shouted. Harold's still hovering. He's looking for a place to land. Listen, boys, the fireman called. Here's a song for Percy. Said Harold, helicopter to our Percy, you are slow. Your railway is out of date and not much use, you know. But Percy with his stone cars did the trip in record time. And we beat the helicopter on our old friend's line. Percy loved it. Oh, thank you, he said. He liked the last line best of all and was a very happy engine. And that concludes the rest of the story. If you haven't if you missed anything, don't forget to leave a comment below. Like if you enjoyed this video. Do not forget to subscribe. But we also got uh, hold it. We still got the winner of that poll, of course. Of course. Unfortunately, we only had one vote for better late than never, so I guess that's where we're going next week. Eek, unfortunately. I mean I mean I would have loved if more people voted. It I mean, oh dear. But yeah, I guess we'll get the, uh, I guess we'll get better late than never over with next week. 
until until next time, this has been Eric Zubik signing off for now. Catch you guys at the next station. Uh, not going to be the favorite one, but uh, then again, it's something. I'll see you guys later. All aboard!